So Instagram has updated some of the first things ambazo nimeziona baada ya kuona Instagram na haya yote tumethibitishiwa na msemaji wa Instagram bwana Moser. Moser amesema Instagram sasa hivi imeleta update ili kuendana na ushindani wa kidunia lakini pia ni ili kurahisisha matumizi na ufanyaji kazi wa creators wao. Sasa kwa Tanzania ama East Africa a little bit tricky kwa sababu sisi kuna update ambazo tuzipati na kuna functionalities ambazo hatuzipati. Lakini leo nataka kukuambia update ambazo unazipata, alafu nitakwambia ambazo uzipate kwa sasa hivi and see if I can make you wiggle. Now, let's start. First update ambayo Instagram wameupdate ni update ya ku schedule posti. Yaani sasa hivi ndani ya Instagram unaweza ukaweka posti alafu ukaipanga itaji posti kesho saa 4. And there inajiposti yenyewe kesho saa 4. Hiyo ni zamani ni function ambayo ilikuwepo but ilikuwa inapatikana kwenye Facebook Business Manager. Ukiingia kwenye Facebook Business Manager baada ya kulink Instagram na Facebook pamoja ndio unaweza kuschedule posti kwenye Facebook au kwenye Instagram. But right now in Instagram as well we can schedule our post. Isn't that cool? <laughs> I find it fascinating. Update number 2 ambayo Instagram wameiweka ume, actually hii na kama wiki kadhaa. Kupitia Mr. Mozera anasema nao Instagram wameweka urais kwa wale ambao wanafutiwa posti zao mara kwa mara. So kama posti zao zinafutwa mara kwa mara, wameweka kitu kinaitwa Instagram note. Instagram note ukiingia kwenye DM yako pale juu utaona kwenye picha yako ya profile kuna kialama cha jumlisha when you press that utaweza kuandika maandishi machache tu ambayo yatakuwa na identify watu wako na pale yale maandishi Instagram wataangalia if yako eligible kuonyeshwa kwa watu wengi if not yeah now we know so note ni nzuri kwa nyie ambao mnafuta futa post zenu kwa mara kwa mara you can use that to uh, to just keep up with your clients and your followers in your fancies right i love that and another function ambayo imeupdateiwa ndani ya Instagram au kitu kimeko ndani ya Instagram is how they plan your DM. Now, we all get DMs, okay? Mimi actually get a lot a lot of DMs. Now, zile DMs zinazokuja ndani ya Instagram sometimes wanakuja watu si wajui. You see? So now on Instagram they have wameka uh, partition tatu. Partition ya kwanza ni partition ya request. So if you never DM'd me before, ina maana ukini DM itaenda kwenye request. And I'll look at it. If I don't like you, sina haja kuiaccept. Sitaanza kuiruhusu kwenda kwenye 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 sehemu yangu ya primary. So that's first. Second utaona sehemu ni kwa general. General ni wale watu ambao they DM you and you respond but uh, they're not so friendly. So watu wako karibu ke hivyo lakini yeah, you DM with them. Alafu kuna primary. Primary sasa ndio wale watu ambao you frequently deal with each other, your friends, you follow them back or what, ambao mko nao in frequent. So, hii inarahisisha kwa nyinyi ma celebrities au watu ambao mnapata DMs nyingi, you can differentiate between the request mtu general na mtu primary. Isn't that cool? I find it fascinating, aren't you? Now, the third function ambayo imeongezwa ndani ya Instagram by the way ni hile professional dashboard. Professional dashboard ni inakusaidia kuona insight ya account yako. Sasa hivi unaje tena kwenda kwenye settings, juu ya insight no. Pale pale umeona kuna inakuonyesha how, how 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 well your account is performing. Now by just clicking there utaona how well your account is performing. Isn't that cool? Now, is any function ambazo as in East Africa tunazipata. Let's talk function ambazo tuzipati and they are cool. It's like a baby with a toys. I just I can't wait to grab one of them, okay? Now, first function ambayo it's always tra troubling you all ni function ambayo inakufanya uzuie matangazo ya watu sponsor ads kupita katika feed yako right feed when i'm talking about feed nazungumzia ile sehemu ambako unaona posti za watu zile eh watu wa follow au labda we are follow that you just see them you follow watu not unaona posti zao so that ile ndio ito feed if function inaruhusu wewe kuzuia usione sponsor ya mtu yote matangazo tangazo ya speed pale ah mm, that's quite amazing function right but currently now east africa we don't have that, sadly. Now, the second function about is wonderful and I can't wait to have this function. I'm telling you, I can't wait to have this function. Ni monetization function by subscription. Iko hivi, ndani ya Instagram, watu tabidi wa subscribe kuanza kuona content zako. Na subscription fee, 
utaipanga we mwenyewe let's say mimi na instagram account yangu nitasema kila mtu wa subscribe kuona posti nitachagua baadhi ya posti ambazo mwezi kuziona mpaka usubscribe na kwenye kusubscribe nitasema mm, kila mmoja anilipe shilingi saba kila mwezi nitawatengenezea posti za mara so if your followers like you that much they will be giving you money elfu saba saba kila mwezi now imagine unachaji elfu mbili and you have 20k followers and everybody paying you 2000 mara watu elfu shirini you have like 40 million do you hear that <sighs> that's money that's money rich eh? that's function ambazo as tanzanians we don't have as kenyans you don't have so for this function actually lazima una 100 100,000 followers kuendelea and kuna eligibility pale ufuate sheria zao na vitu kama vile lakini ah i can't wait to have this function anyway but we don't have by the way this app for me today kama ume enjoy kama you love tell me kwenye comment in the function again ambayo umeko fascinate kama mimi nilikuwa fascinate and if you have anything if you have any question anything you want to know about social media just holla at me to neto dukahuru until next time follow subscription is all about you If you join please we love you to see you here in our family this is the winner cycle and until next time peace